Hello, I'm going to give an overview of our paper, uh, Efficiency of the JLI Second Price Auction with Value Maximizers. So first, some basic background about Alibidding and Value Maximizers. So uh, Alibidding is a uh, auction scheme for advertising online. And in fact, it's the dominant scheme, which handles over 80% of all online advertising traffic. So what's different about alibidding and alibiders is that alibiders are target driven. They're not like classic uh, utility maximizers in uh, microeconomics. So for example, alibiders usually want to get as many acquisitions as possible, subject to the constraint that the cost per acquisition doesn't exceed a certain threshold. So in short, uh, common alibiders are uh, value maximizers subject to ROI constraints, that is uh, return on investment constraints. Okay, so uh, what's in this paper? Uh, what we had known before this paper is the efficiency of the first price auction and the second price auction, both are very common auction formats. And here efficiency is measured by the ratio between the worst case welfare generated by the auction and the optimal welfare. So what we know is that FPA and SBA uh, both get one half of the optimal welfare in the worst case. So they are pretty competitive and the competitive ratio, the, uh, the ratio between the worst case welfare and the optimal welfare uh, is a constant, which is one half. So this paper is about generalized second price auctions or GSP. What's special about GSP is uh, there's multiple slots to be allocated, and these slots are uh, associated with decreasing discount factors. So for example, these are uh, uh, predicted CTRs, uh, click-through rates. So the discount factors, they should be multiplied with the value and the product contributes to the welfare. Okay, so what we show for GSP is that the efficiency of GSP lies somewhere between zero and one half. And the precise ratio actually depends on the discount factors. So we give a bound, which is a function of the discount factors. So uh, the formula is kind of involved, but the takeaway message is that uh, we generally want the discount factors to decrease smoothly. And the more smooth they uh, they are, the better efficiency we get. Uh, 